Welcome and welcome back to my channel. It's Katora and this video is going to be a week in my life vlog or a day in my life vlog. I'm not really sure yet. Today's gonna be pretty eventful. It's 8.51 right now. I've been up for a while. I've been up for like two hours. I just got out the shower and moisturized, which is why I probably look greasy. <laughs> I just wanted to check in. I'm gonna finish out my morning routine, do a little yoga flow, and I'll get back to you guys when I'm actually gonna start my day. But we're currently on the way to go pick up my mom and I's dry cleaning. It's brick outside, it's raining. And I'm just like, do I even want to go outside today? After I pick up this dry cleaning, I'm just going to head back home and start getting ready to go. We're going thrifting today. Anyways, let's just go pick up this shit real quick because I don't even want to be outside right now. Like, I'm cold. Clearly. I've been home for like way too long. I honestly don't know what I'm wearing. I just know that I want to wear this shirt. Shout out to the girl who sold this to me. She gave me a really good price on this vintage Jean-Paul Gaultier. I love this shirt. Let's do my makeup. I'm just thinking out loud. Please don't you mind me. When you talk about me, speak highly. Diamonds on me doing high knees. Stick together like we Chinese Shine bright like some high beams My bitch a boss like Kylie I pray a nigga don't try me Cause we gon' beat him till his eyes bleed Nigga look just like a zombie Like ain't no play about me Yeah, yeah Better watch how you move I'm tryna go on the move I'm tryna be on the move Maybe let's go to the moon We don't got nothing to lose tonight Just saying Don't wake me up Don't you wake me up Don't you wake me up Don't wake me up Nobody wake me up Nobody wake me up Please don't wake me up Don't wake me up Malibu, Topanga, baby, Cancun, it's up to you, what we do, where the hell we going? I'm gonna come back when I'm done because this is gonna take a minute. <laughs> Alright y'all, I'm finally done with my makeup. It took me very long to do this shit for some reason. But I had to make my eyebrows match my shirt and it was difficult. Shut up, Zed. <laughs> it was difficult because my eyebrows are already like really dark now, so it was hard to cover them. Yeah, I did the damn thing. But let me, <laughs> let me, you make me feel so weird talking <laughs> while I'm filming. But I'm about to put some clothes on. I just don't even know what to put on. I think I'm gonna just put on some black pants. Huh? Wait, I was gonna wear That's what I was gonna wear because I'm like, I don't want my feet to be cold. Uh, let me see how that looks. All right, babe. So, this is the outfit. I'm wearing my vintage Jean Paul Gaultier top, thrifted jeans, and belt. And I got these Alexander Wayne boots from the Real Real on consignment. And yeah, this is the outfit. This sweater i know that it's like probably a lot with the shirt but i really want to wear a gray sweater and this is my only gray sweater so it's vivian westwood it's also vintage it's fine because you can't even see the pattern on it it's just the hood that's showing so i'm going to put a scarf on and excuse me <laughs> i just realized i still have this scarf on my head why didn't y'all tell me it's got my gray puffer i'm just not gonna wear a scarf because i can't ruin the fit man it's not about being man it's it's never about being warm. it's about being fly so currently walking to the first thrift store that i'm headed to today i'm literally about to be there but honestly this store is really close to my house and i thought it would take me way longer to get here but i got here in like 30 minutes yo i'm back on the train because the store that i was trying to go to is closed so we're just gonna go to manhattan Find some stores out there. It's 
colder here and raining harder here. First of all, I'm in the fitting room for this thrift store, but I just want to say it's not easy filming while thrifting, especially in New York City where there's hella people in the store. And my bag is just really heavy, so my arms were really tired without me even carrying the camera. I found two items in this, well, three. Um, I put two of them on the counter, but I'm about to try on this one jacket that I found. I think it's undercover. Yeah, it's undercover. Let's get into the fit. Let's get into the look. This way, y'all really gotta get into it. The sleeves are kind of short, but honestly, I fuck with it, and it honestly even goes with my outfit right now. Mm. Personally, I like when my sleeves are like really long. Yeah, I'm gonna get it. So, I got the jacket. And I got a few other things as well. Recording while thrifting is not fucking easy. My arm already hurts from my purse and then swiping through the shit just makes it hurt even more. So y'all just gonna have to see the thrift haul when I get home. This bitch showed up finally <laughs> with her hey bunny gear bucket hat. Wait, get the... It's a real, it's an ugly ass day in New York. Like we really the only good looking things outside right now. Like, like these niggas can never, New York can never. <laughs> Yo, we're about to go to Namaste Art Crystal Shop. Hold on, guys. Come. <laughs> Yo, oh, your hat is so cute. Thank you. It's by Vern Dallas. Ooh. Hi to me. Watch out. <laughs> I'm sorry. I mean, I feel like Apple Pay is like not real. Like, it's monopoly. Yeah, I literally do the same thing. <laughs> Wait! Bitch, you wanna die? In me. Hey, 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 hey. I think I have this light, to be honest. This shit just made me wanna shake my ass. Black girl, black girl. Oh, wait, fuck. Um, we look crazy. We're going through it in this yeah, cold. We are. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna go to Second Street now. Guys, I want to buy this shirt, but I'm probably not gonna buy it. It's 200, and I said that you should buy it. It's Comte de Garçon. But I'm gonna, gonna try it on. This is so cute. I feel like you're gonna try it on and fall in love with it. They look big. What size do they look? Oh, they're only 33. Y'all want to see this fine ass African man? <laughs> well, I got him. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like this cut either. Like that's not cute. It's not giving y'all. They're a little bit tight. Looks like I'm not getting anything from here, guys. I'm sad, but I'm gonna just try to go drifting again later this week. Hopefully, Zen doesn't take five years next time, so we can actually get to the stores earlier and actually find some good stuff. But I did get a lot of good stuff so far from the other stores. I'm just kind of sad because this store has a lot of good stuff most of the time. And today wasn't really my day. But you know, 
next time. Hey, what y'all think about this vest? She a bad it's given. Yeah. It's given. Give us some poses. Uh, period. Yes. Switch up. Right, we're not sure. Oh. My shit is done. We're getting food. I already we're ate one. Yeah, I ate like most it. of mine already. <laughs> why you? Because why are you trying why to eat mine? <laughs> Cause I don't have any more. We're back at Coco Buki and we're about to get Kazoo Back rice. with another kanger. My camera is dying though, so. Why is everything dying? Uh, <laughs> What's this called again? I don't know, but it's good. Zen loves it. Mm -hmm. She was just bodying the fucking bowl you right here. Too. Shut up. I was. No. <laughs> We're home, guys. Zen's over here being an old lady. She wanna go to sleep, but I'm not gonna show you guys what I bought from the thrift store. The first item is this hat. It's so freaking cute, but it makes my head look big. But it's so cute. I wish a time machine. I wish. <laughs> Put them on. <laughs> Put them on. <laughs> What's the giving? <laughs> Wait, can we play that? Yeah. <laughs> What's that song called again? Bee boo bop. Bee boo bop. Is it this one? Oh. It's not it, right? No, hold on, but that was giving me. Hey. Oh, I don't know this thing. <laughs> no, I was gonna be like, oh. Uh huh. Corduroy, this corduroy coat, corduroy, little corduroy thing. I got this from Buffalo Exchange. Yeah, Buffalo. I got it from Buffalo Exchange. Honestly, everything I got was pretty much from Buffalo Exchange. Y'all, I dropped my camera and we're trying to figure out how to get it to work again. It's like stuck because the lens won't close. Pray for me, I'm sad, but I'm hopeful that I can get it fixed. So now I'm not really doing anything anyway, so it's like whatever. I was gonna start filming again on Wednesday anyways, but you know, hopefully everything works out. If all else fails, I hope y'all enjoyed this little vlog. And I love you guys, I'm sad, but you know what? I'm gonna figure it out. Hey y'all, I've been home for a little while now. I'm just super tired, but I got my camera back and that's all that matters. Even though it was mad work today, just getting it fixed. I literally was driving around for like four or five hours and I got no sleep last night. So that was just not it, but I'm gonna go to bed now. And I have a nail appointment at 1 p.m. tomorrow. So I'm gonna be taking you guys with me and yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm getting ready to go to my nail appointment right now. I am rushing, which is why I'm literally just talking so fast. I'm about to put some clothes on so we can head out of here. It's 12.34 and my nail appointment is at one. Honestly, I'm on time all the time, so I'm not like too frantic, but I'm just the type of person where I don't like having people wait on me, even though people always have me waiting on them all the time. I'm not that type of bitch. I'm going to rush and act like the world is ending until I get out of the house because I really just 
don't like having people wait on me. It's a really nice day outside. I'm gonna put on this jacket. I know I wanna wear this, but I just don't know what pants to wear. I know what shoes I'm wearing too, but I really don't know what pants to put on. Like, I'm gonna put on my capital smiley face sweatpants. Should I leave this shirt on? It's not even black though, it's like blue. I'm gonna just put on a black tank top because I just really don't feel like continuing to look. And it really doesn't matter because I'm probably gonna come straight home after my nail appointment. I have a black tank top on, my hysteric jacket, um, capital pants, and I have my skeleton Air Force Ones on. Called Air Force One? I don't know. I've had these shits for so long, literally since like 2018. That beating tip. Laughing that song. Thank you. Appreciate you. Gotta let it. This is my nail tag. Yabo dog. Period. Period. Fucking yes. Yeah. My mom's boyfriend's sister. I'm crying. Oh wow. I thought you were gonna say Lauren Hill because. <laughs> That. <laughs> no. Not about Lauren Hill. Literally, bro, everybody and their fucking mother tells me I look like Lauren Hill. <laughs> really do No, I don't. I really don't, bro. I look like my dad. <laughs> I'm going to the store because I'm thirsty. Should I get? I can't get no drinks. I'm driving. That's how you know I'm a new driver because I really, I low key just want to do what the fuck I want. I'm trying to think if I should get munchies, but I don't want to keep eating while she's doing my nails. But I'm hungry still. These people forgot my fucking chips for my pico de gallo. Thank you. Such a nice day. Like, why am I wearing a sweater outside? What's today? I mean, I forgot what month it is. In February, I'm wearing a sweater outside. Dubai. Yeah, because it's just me. I'm the chosen one. Oh my god, this is fire. Shut up. I already know. I ain't use pearls. I use on um, the opal. Look at that. You shit me? Come on. Stop playing with y'all both <laughs> dog. Eleven thirty-two. Honestly, honestly. Good morning, my friends. I pretty much just woke up. I don't even know what time it is. It's nine thirty. I've been up since like eight. I'm about to start my morning routine, but I'm so tired. Like I've literally been running around every day this week. Yesterday I got home at like almost 12. I lied, I got home at like 11. But yeah, I am really tired and I don't really have too much planned for today. I think I'm gonna probably do my taxes today. Boring adult stuff. But yeah, I got my nails done, they're super fucking cute. It's very curly for me, but it's Valentine's Day, so I figured why not get my nails Valentine's Day themed since I'm not really going to be doing anything. Don't have a Valentine, but it's okay because I'm going to be chilling with my 
close friends on Valentine's Day and I'm probably gonna get a Yoni steam that day too and yeah I'm just gonna have fun fuck a Valentine honestly <laughs> today is gonna be pretty boring I'm glad though cuz I need today to be boring I'm supposed to have a shoot tomorrow but I haven't sent the photographer the looks yet so I'm gonna do that today I'm gonna do my morning routine after I finish eating this cereal and I'll come back when I got something going on because it's really it's a chill day I'm doing my makeup right now because I don't really have anything planned for today and I figured why not do like a Valentine's Day themed look and go to the park since it's been a long time since I've spent some time in nature and it's actually so nice outside like lately these past few days it's been really nice in New York I don't know what's going on if spring is coming early but let me not jinx that shit also, I'm fried right now, y'all. I smoked in the shower before I did yoga, and I was just like really fucking fried. I'm not too fried anymore, but when I was doing yoga, it was so fucking hot. I did not even mean to get that hot. Yeah, that's what we're doing today. I'm probably just gonna keep this fit on because it's cozy as fuck. Like, the important thing is just my face. I don't know if I'm gonna do pink eyebrows or just a pink eyeliner look maybe both it's one o'clock right now 106 it's still pretty early i don't know why i thought it was getting late but i've been up for a while now um so yeah let's just do this makeup i need to do my edges too but i'm just like so fried i'm not even like knowing what to do right now like My camera died so I didn't film the whole process but this is the look I tried to do something that wasn't gonna take me five hours it's been like an hour and a half it's supposed to be like four o'clock so yeah I got little hearts you guys see yeah I have little hearts and I put some dots simple Valentine's Day-esque and these eyebrows really go with these two nails. I was taking some pictures right here, but like, I'd rather take pictures outside. I really like this look. It didn't come out like, like honestly, I just winged it. Like, I just did whatever came to mind. And it's, it's giving. I 
Oh, it's so cute. I really like the white liner that I did. Kind of tied everything together. But yeah. I really fucks with it. It's 3.40 right now, so we're about to walk to the park and I'm gonna take my journal, some snacks, and some water, my spliff, and we're just gonna ground ourselves today and take some cute pictures in the sun. But I'm gonna keep this fit on even though I got hella makeup on it because I just don't feel like changing, like it's not that serious. Literally going to the park. I might change my pants since they're white. You know, the face is beat. Like, it really does not matter what I'm wearing. I could not roll just now with these nails. So, I'm just going to take the clip that I was smoking earlier. Because I'm not feeling to smoke like that anyways. I'm wearing the same tank I was wearing. Dad jeans. My beaters. Brick bag. Same jacket I was wearing yesterday because it's cozy. It is really beautiful outside though and I'm just really happy because the weather really does affect how I feel sometimes and good weather always makes me happy as fuck. I gotta walk around because it's too cold to be sitting in one spot. Like, I really underestimated this weather. And I always do, but I thought today was gonna be different. <laughs> my ass is anemic and too cold, it's too cold, my nigga. But I'm still happy as shit, like, just being here. Let me show y'all. We made a couple movies and we took a few flicks. I was feeling moody to sound in my mood switch. Bro, got two sticks. Get your plug just like acoustics. Bro, I'm ruthless. Lead toothless. They hate on me. I'm like, who is this? I don't know nobody. They some goofies. All they do is dig rock. Baby, open wide. Let me slip inside. Shotty wet it, then it slip inside. Trying to dip and die. Take a play. I be on the fly. There was just birds flying in formation. <laughs> Y'all, I'm just sitting here thinking mad hard. <laughs> Even though, like, sometimes my thoughts do be bothering me, like, it's just annoying being such a thoughtful person <laughs> I'm just I'm grateful for my self-awareness and I just really need to start giving myself credit where it's due because I don't do that enough and I feel like that's why I always have the thoughts that I have from time to time but it's time that I start giving myself my flowers again because I've been slacking and that's not okay. Like, at the end of the day, you need to be your biggest supporter, your biggest support system. Not to say 
say that I don't support myself because I support myself so much every single day and honestly I'm proud of myself for just all of the discipline that I've implemented in my life so far and it was really quick too honestly in my opinion like I really just wanted that security in my life so bad that I just cultivated that shit like magic when I really you know put my fucking all into that shit and dedicated myself to growth and just mindfulness and all that gratitude and I'm just grateful I just need to continue to affirm and remind myself that I'm doing amazing and there's no reason for me to feel like I'm not or doubt that I'm doing you know enough or on the right path because at the end of the day I know that I am where I'm supposed to be and I say this often but it's one thing saying it then like listening to it actually like embodying it but it's time it's time that I start embodying that shit more but I'm putting the work in you know it's just about me staying consistent and I have been so I'm proud of myself I don't know what's going on with the planets right now I haven't like checked on the planets in like a week or something like that but something definitely has to be going on because the conversation that I had with my nail tech yesterday and just everybody in the shop we were all just like yeah something's definitely up some I don't know I really don't know but something's going on because everybody's like everybody's feeling similarly like and I don't know, it's just weird. It's not a fucking coincidence that everybody's kind of going through similar shit right now. Like, I don't know what's going on, y'all, but something going on. I'm cold as shit. My nose is literally leaking. Like, this always fucking happens. I be feeling to go outside in the cold knowing that I suffer every time. But it's worth it just to be in the sun and to be at home with Mother Earth. <gasps> oh my God. They're so close. Say hi. <laughs> hey. Y'all are actually saying hi. <laughs> y'all are gonna see y'all ads in the vlog. So, special appearance. <laughs> y'all just keep going. <laughs> yeah, so I got home and I just went live. Like, literally went live as I was walking home because I haven't gone live in a minute. And I'm still trying on live with y'all. Chopping it up, but I don't know. We gonna see what I do later. These slap. I got them on GoPuff once, and I never like ever since I got them. I just never stopped eating them. You ever think about like how many people have your pictures in their camera roll? I don't think about that. Like, at all. <laughs> I was just talking about earlier when I first got on live, like, it doesn't, like, the amount of people that perceive me, like, I understand how many people it is, but, like, in my head, it's hard for me to, like, fathom, like, how many people it really is. Like, I don't see it for as much as it really is. That's why I don't be giving myself my flowers like that, but, you know. The learning process. Humble queen. <laughs> I'm too fucking humble. I need to start popping my shit. Popping. I don't trust the process. Yeah, me too. I am though. I'm content with my hair how it is. I just, I see its potential. Like, 
I think that my day is pretty much over. Like, I think I'm just gonna be chilling for the rest of the day. I don't really have nothing else to do except confirm everything with my photographer about tomorrow's shoot. I'm chilling. I'm gonna keep this makeup on though for a little bit because like I put all this effort into it. Good morning, y'all. It's the day of my shoot and it is 11 o'clock in the morning. Literally, I was in the middle of doing my makeup when my photographer just texted me and said that the owner of the studio said that something came up and we can no longer shoot there. It was supposed to be at three o'clock. We still have time to find another studio, but I'm just hoping that we can find one in the same area because that's the most convenient area for me. I'm gonna look for a studio as I do my makeup and hopefully I get to find one. He's also looking as well, but that kind of just blew my, I'm not gonna lie. Cause like I'm literally got one eyebrow done. Like my nigga, what's going on? Regardless, we could shoot outside, but I really wanted to do a studio shoot today. So hopefully that works out, but I'm gonna get back to y'all when I'm done with my makeup because I just wanna get this shit done already. Like I don't have time. <laughs> Hey y'all, it's been a little minute. I'm pretty much ready. I'm not dressed yet, but I kind of have an idea what I'm wearing. It's not gonna be what I'm shooting in. I don't, I think, I don't know if we're gonna take pictures in my outfit. We probably are, cause it looks good. But yeah, we found a new studio. It's currently one. I'm not sure if he still wants to book this studio at three. We're still like deciding right now, but I'm about to head out um, in a few to hit some thrift stores. So I'm gonna put my clothes on so we can start heading outside because I wanted to leave at 12, but it is now 1.17. And that's not too bad, but like, I'm the type of person that needs extra time. So, you know, I need as much time that I could get. I'm gonna have to put a different shirt on because I don't like how these look closed like i want to wear all of these open but i'm gonna be freezing all right y'all so i ended up putting on this auburn i don't know if that's the color like rusty orange sweater because it looks good zipped up and then i have this isemiyake vest on underneath this leather jacket that i thrifted um, I have these thrifted Carhartt pants on. I really didn't want to wear these pants because I'm like, am I ODing with the brown right now? But it's just giving like monochrome kind of, or whatever the word is when you're wearing like the same color with different tones. Anyways, that's what it's giving. And then I have the BB Simon belt that I got from somebody. I have my tabbies on so let's get the fuck out of here because i'm sweating and shit i'm gonna take this jacket off i'm also gonna bring my slippers with me because i don't think i could drive with these shoes on so i'm in the car i'm not gonna film while i'm driving because guys don't be a op but i do not have my l word and i just started learning how to drive for real last month in january so i'm still learning the roads i'm still learning the rules of the roads and it's really distracting when i have the camera like flying all over the place <laughs> trying to get it like to stay still it's just really distracting so i'm going to be a safe driver and i'm not going to film today while i'm driving but i'm gonna just see you guys um when i get to bushwick we're here at the thrift store well we're close i was struggling to find parking for a minute but i found a parking spot so i just gotta put my shoes back on because i could not drive in these also this is what i was trying to show y'all earlier like the reflective feel i'm excited because i seen this lady on tiktok and she seems like a really good fucking time so i hope that i'm not awkward and actually get to have a conversation with her but yeah, she just seems like a fucking ball of joy. And she has this dog. I don't know if she brings her dog to work, but I've seen her videos on TikTok so many times. And I was just like, yeah, I'm going here. Yeah, it's Mo Vinci Johnny here, the leader of the old school. Mama Poopy Butt, come and check us out. Yes, uh, I right love here. it here. Wow. <laughs> Girl, yes, so many vintage finds. Wow, I didn't even see this. Nah, I want this. I want this one. 
This is a cool ass jacket. I wouldn't wear it because I don't know how I would style that, but that's fire. Get it, Lauren Hill. You're right. So cute. And thank you so much for stopping by, shopping with us. Thank you. Bread and all this support. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi, Gooby Say hi, Instagrammers, TikTokers. Got some YouTubers. goodies. <laughs> yes. You missed it. She got it. Pow. I'm at Beacon's closet. Kind of rushing because it's 5:30. Probably gonna be a little bit late, but not too late. But let's get in there and see if they even have anything. Like I thought, we didn't find anything, but. I honestly already expected that. I looked through most of their pants, which is what I was looking for, and like skirts. Didn't have shit, so we're just gonna have to work with what we got, but I'm about to be on my way to the shoot now. My photographer is pretty much the same distance away as I am, so yeah, we out. Hi guys. Let me cover my titties. <laughs> but I'm at the studio, and we're just preparing connecting to Alexa and all that. Figuring out what to wear. I honestly don't even know what to fucking wear. I'm probably just gonna put my outfit on. And yeah. <laughs> I'm probably just gonna put back on what I was wearing all day because that was really the best thing. I kind of baited today. Can't even lie. You're not gonna say nothing. Hello. <laughs> Yeah, I've been talking to the men in the mirror. Yeah, yeah. Working the map, 
spin around 285 doing laps. Run with the work if they win, we adapt. Travel Missouri, got the guts to attack. Covered in black, shipping out apples, no orchard and back. Dripping like porridge, I know they gon' jack. Put them on instant, instant, no lag. Nobody comparing, I see him in terror. I feel like I'm draws on they fish in the back. I'm from the flat in the net. Come through the know you get left in the back. I'm selling Doja with older, no cat. Told him my Doja can't wait for the plaques. Stay with the chair like a pair of MX. Down in the mess with the four of the back. With the four of the back. Don't gotta sleep when I'm dead. I go to sleep when I'm freaking some head. Yeah, eating with feast. My youngest rise in the oven like yeast. Yeah, more than a beast. Mommy, you must eat more than you leave. We just a war of a peace. You to that pressure, we can't run a deep. Yeah, I'm so over the edge, my pill up in the neon tech. Mine and day, my adjustment, the came in, dripped and all the sense of swag. You want some shit that I ain't. But you should like three, get cut, no shame. It ain't nothing to me. Why you give you two sides like a something to me? I can tell you, I hope more reluctantly. I'm the fly, it's also got him beaming me up. I took a half of my lip pillars, keeping me. I had to ask the bitches started creeping me up. Still cold like I gotta need me a nigga. And a little money, I got greedy, oh yeah. Chill, dedicate my little bitch. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. She's supposed to be the driver and she's drinking. So I guess I'm the driver again. Yeah, she's the driver. This nigga got Sprite. I'm gonna wanna, I'm gonna wanna, no, that's not Sprite. That's, <laughs> that's, that's, that's flat. What is it? That's, that's flat. They don't know about it. They don't know about it. It's also my And he got no it. Bad. water. <laughs> water. What? I got water too. Balsamic vinegar. Balsamic vinegar? That's a big word for That's a big word. Ooh, it look good on camera. Yeah. Wait, where's the soy sauce? Zan? Hey. Who is that? The moon. The moon. Never again, bro. <laughs> so it's three in the morning, it's three forty two. Can you see? It's three forty three in the morning. And yeah. we just got home, bro. This bitch drove us home. Um while well, kinda intoxicated, <laughs> but we're just never gonna do that again because uh, that's just not okay but we were chilling we were chilling anyways this is gonna be the last day that i'm filming it's friday and yeah this is it for my weekly vlog but i wanted to talk some shit because we just came from this event i'm not gonna name it or no names or nothing like that no shame no shame but, but that shit was basura like i'm sorry it was just terrible off the energy I was staticky from the jump, to be honest. Like, literally off rip, the energy was just not good. Everybody outside was acting weird when it was time to like enter the the venue. It was just weird. Niggas was just staring at us. Like, I don't even know how to explain it. But we got in. The energy was just all. Um, I mean, it was kind of mixy for me because I seen people that I didn't want to see. This one bitch, she just hit me mad hard with her bag, so I pushed her back. <laughs> like, it was just mad shit going on, bro. And, like, honestly, just to be around that energy, like, you know, we try to give it chances. Like, you know, we just, it, it it's we okay need to, stop to dance. It chances, basically. Yeah, it's okay to want to dance, to want to have fun and shit like that. But these parties are just not it. Like, these niggas, for one, people in general, they don't dance. Like, I mean, I think the girls, the girls wanted to dance, but like the DJ, when he was white on Black yeah, History why? Month. Bro, they had a white DJ and he didn't even know like really what to play. I feel like when she asked, like, cause I've heard, I heard a lot of people requesting. Bro, we were chanting. Music. Like it wasn't even just us, it was mad different people like throughout Break the party. Reggaeton, like something, like give it something. Yeah, like dance music, but they did not want to play that shit, bro. Like it was just like, like fashion niggas trying to look cool, 
Japanese Like you know that shit. Cardi sound, like that Cardi so shit, trippy bad, bad shit, like, like over red, boring, cliche. Like it's okay to play a little bit of that shit, but like not on. the whole time. Like niggas, like literally nobody was dancing. Everybody was just looking at each other mad weird because like that was just not setting the tone of the party. Like honestly, play something. I mean, when they played Soulja Boy, you know that one song, niggas started dancing. But like after that, it was clear. Yeah. Um, and like some jay it's just not a vibe bro these scene niggas these scene parties do not a vibe if you live in new york please avoid them at all costs like mm -hmm. do not go to them scene parties unless you're like one of those people who like to stand around mm, trying to just, look cool because that shit is not niggas vibe. actually look dumb that's the funny part that's what i'm saying like y'all realize dumb, like, that niggas could really see right through that facade of you trying to look cool and the whole time you look mad weird and uncomfortable like come on yeah, you over here like <laughs> nigga get a like, summer walker, like stop. <laughs> you feel me? Like no bro. But yeah, these New York scenes. It's parties. only the hood parties where people are jumping from the roof onto some punani. It's like that's the poo -poo. only you know what I'm saying? That's the only parties that we're going to where niggas know how to have fun and dance. Like if y'all know, if y'all know some parties like that in New York, holla at us. Okay? That's not happening until the summertime probably, but yeah, yeah, I just realized that like I'm just not a party person and I realized this a long time ago But I keep giving myself giving nah, them bro, chances. We're party people. We're I'm party really people, not. but just not that type of party Like it just has to be the right setting. I like, Cause you know, we gonna yeah. turn up Cause we are the party like, you know, we, we like to dance. We like to have fun, but it just depends on where it is like uh, what's the vibes what we're doing my neck hurt i can't do this my camera's dying anyway so it's time to close out this vlog i hope you guys enjoyed this week in my life vlog and have fun doing all these things with me and let me know if you guys want more videos like this and leave a like comment and subscribe for your girl i love y'all have an amazing day morning and night